Howdy my fellow gamers and welcome back to the gaming stealth. While many Grand Theft Auto fans celebrated the game's anniversary, others used it as an opportunity to raise the question of everyone's mind, where is GTA 6? Unfortunately, we don't have an answer to this. While it's been 7 years since GTA 5 hit, it's important to remember that just 2 years ago Rockstar Games delivered Red Dead Redemption 2. In other words, it hasn't been that long since Rockstar Games put out a project, but that isn't stopping people from pestering the company about GTA 6. Addressing all of this, actor Sean Fantino, who played Franklin Clinton in GTA 5, pleaded with GTA fans to have some patience, reminding them that the game development takes time, especially when you're making games as big and ambitious as Rockstar does. The voice actor also suggests that COVID has been a problem as well. Don't knock Rockstar down, man. Don't be on them. I see their posts. Y'all be on Rockstar's head talking about y'all milking GTA 5, and when is GTA 6 coming out? Y'all gotta understand, man. It's a process to put these games out, said the actor. COVID hit, so it's slowing things down. They can't just throw anything out. Y'all wouldn't accept if it threw a GTA 6 out right now and just had bullshit. Then y'all wouldn't support Rockstar. Y'all would stop supporting the GTA brand. Now, it's unclear if Fontenot has any inside knowledge here, presumably he doesn't, unless Franklin is returning in GTA 6, but given everything we unofficially know about the game, that seems very unlikely. That said, having worked on GTA 5, he obviously has more knowledge than the rest of us when it comes to Rockstar Games and game development under it. There were three years between the release of GTA 5 and the reveal of Red Dead Redemption 2. Assuming Rockstar Games continues this pattern, GTA 6 should be revealed in 2021, However, it's also possible that we won't see the game until 2022 due to COVID delays and the fact that GTA 5 is coming to PS5 and the Xbox Series X next year. That said, when a new leak surfaced online, it got GTA fans desperate for information super excited. As you may have noticed, a new leak has been making the rounds involving a website domain for GTA Vice City Online, which is owned by Rockstar Games' parent company Take-Two Interactive. On the surface level, this domain seemingly confirms that GTA 6, or at least GTA Online, is heading to Vice City. However, there's a problem. It was filed back in 2009, which goes unmentioned in most reports. In other words, this appears to be nothing more than Take-Two Interactive future-proofing by gobbling up any relevant domain names to GTA Online so they don't have to deal with squatters later. Back in 2009, GTA 5 was still in the early stages of development, so it's unlikely Rockstar Games knew where GTA 6 is going to be set, so it's unlikely this involves GTA 6. The current rumors and reports claim GTA 6 will bring back players of Vice City, but this seems to be nothing more than a coincidence. At the moment of publishing, neither Rockstar Games nor Take-Two Interactive have commented on this leak, and at this point, it's unlikely they will leaving GTA fans with nothing but speculation for now. Rockstar Games has lost some crucial members of its team recently. In 2016, it lost the lead developer on the GTA series, Leslie Benzies. This was a huge blow. Earlier this year, another haymaker caught GTA fans off guard when Dan Hauser unexpectedly left the company he helped found back in 1998. Hauser was more than just a co-founder though. He was the studio's head writer, a producer, and the vice president of creativity. Alongside his brother Sam Hauser, he was Rockstar Games. At this point, GTA fans were already out cold in the ground, but the bad news didn't stop there. This week, it was revealed that Laszlo Jones also departed Rockstar Games earlier this year after 20 years of the company. Jones was not only a writer and producer of the series, but the host of GTA radio stations. I hope this gives you guys some more insight into when GTA 6 will come out and why it isn't out yet. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click on the videos on screen now or that are linked in the description below. Please be sure to like and subscribe and click the bell to get notified of every video. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Later.